Assalamu alaikum. I am Mirza Suhaib Beg and uh, you are watching my channel. Uh, uh, today I am going to explain the chordate diversity and uh, uh, this one belongs to the Miller Hadley and uh, the chapter name is Glass Mammalia. Uh, this one is, uh, this, uh, there are some most important objectives related to this uh, Glass Mammalia chapter uh, for the students of BS, ADP, PPSC, FPSC and MDGAD. So what kind of objectives uh, present here? And what do you say about mammals? Mammals are the uh, special group of animals that have uh, memory glands on their body and they, uh, they have hairs uh, on their skin, like uh, you can see here. Uh, here is a uh, bear and uh, with, with his cub. And uh, uh, this one is a beautiful uh, kind of, uh, uh, not only beautiful, this one is also a, a predatory kind of uh, animal, or you can say mammal. So let's start with the name of Al Almighty, Bismillahir Rahmanir Rahim. So the first MCQ, the beginning of the blank, about 70 million years ago, was the start of age of mammal. वो कौन सा ऐसा time period था जब जो है age of mammal start हुई तकरीबन आज से 70 million साल पहले पहले अगर देखा जाए, so either this one is belong to the tertiary period, quaternary period, cretaceous period, or jurassic period. Right answer is tertiary period because the tertiary period was the age was the origin or you can say that, say that the start of uh, the age of uh, mammals when the mammals are going to become uh, abundant so the first uh mcq have the answer a alpha by the middle of permian period uh, other successful mammal like reptiles had arisen from the pelycosaurs known as uh, middle of uh, permian period uh, uh say to have a core uh, successful mammal like reptile to have arise kya and uh, uh, th that uh, mammal-like reptile was originated or was arisen from the plicosaurs and the plicosaur known as uh, this one uh, or organism that arises from plicosaur name is uh, or the group name is this one is known as the cartilosaur, therapsid, therapsid, arcosaur. The right answer is therapsid, uh, option C. So therapsid was originated from uh, plicosaurs. So next one, the last therapsid were a group card. The last therapsid uh, were a group card and the group name of last therapsid is cyanodonts. So cyanodonts uh, was belong to the last therapsid. The MCQ number four, the first mammal were small. Uh, the first mammals were small. Uh, they uh, are less than blank long with delicate skeleton. So uh, almost the first mammal was really small in size and uh, uh, the size of that mammal uh, was about uh, 10 centimeter. The next one MCQ is MCQ number five. Some zoologists speculate that uh, some small uh, species or small size, well-developed olfactory and auditory abilities and lack of color vision in most mammals suggest that early mammal were. Uh, you can see that uh, small sized uh, or uh, less developed uh, olfactory and auditory abilities uh, or the absence of the color vision, uh, that means uh, the absence of uh, um, specialized kind of options in their eyes and the mammals in early time period uh, due to the absence of color vision they have the special kind of behavior and uh, such kind of behavior was a nocturnal behavior that means they were active uh, during the night time so mcq number six beavers belongs to order uh, they uh, beaver is a kind of rodents so def definitely uh, this one is not belong to cetacea carnivora proboscidea uh, so that's why the right answer is option C, Rodentia, uh, like the rats uh, and uh, uh, rats belong to this group. Elephants belong to the order. The elephant have a long proboscis. So very simple to give the answer of this question. Uh, and the answer is the proboscidea due to the presence of the proboscis. Next MCU, bats belong to order. Uh, order Legomorpha? No, because the Legomorpha uh, is the order of uh, rabbits. A proboscidea is the order of uh, elephant and rodentia is the order of beavers, rats. Uh, so the last option is option A. Uh, I uh, Not, I think, I'm sure the order of uh, bat is the chiroptera. So chiroptera is the order uh, from which the bats belong. The blank species of monotremes are found in Australia and New Guinea. Uh, how many species of monotremes uh, that are found, that was found in uh, uh, Australia uh, and New Guinea, there are almost six species of monodremes at that time. And now they are also existed. So the six species of monodremes that are found in Australia and New Guinea um, of monodremes. 
So the MCQ number 10, a protective pouch called the marsupium covers a female. Uh, in in case of some mammals, uh, they have this uh, they have the special kind of uh, uh, marsupium or protective pouch, and it covers the which part of the female body in uh, marsupial mammals. Either this one is the protective pouch for the salivary gland, for the mammary gland, sebaceous gland, or musk gland. Uh, the right answer is mammary gland because uh, uh, some uh, kind of uh, marsupial mammals. Uh, have uh, uh, marsupial mammal females have mammary glands and uh, uh, they rear their young ones in that marsupium uh, after the birth of their young ones. So that's why the protective pouch uh, marsupium covers the mammary glands. So option B is the right answer for MCQ number 10. Mammals are naturally distributed over all over the continents except, except Antarctica because Antarctica is a very harsh condition, is a very harsh condition and uh, uh, it, the survival of animal uh, is not too much uh, easy uh, in that region. So uh, in Africa region, in America, Australia, uh, mammals are present uh, abundantly. But uh, in case of it, in, uh, in the region of uh, Antarctica, uh, the right answer of uh, this MCQ is, is a very harsh condition. So. Next one, hair is a keratinized derivative of the blank of the skin. Uh, hair is a keratinized structure and uh, uh, this one arises from, uh, either this one arises from dermis, epidermis, hypodermis, endodermis. The right answer is epidermis. Epidermis, from the epidermis, the keratinized hairs can be originated. A coat of hair in mammals card. Plumage, no, because plumage is the uh, insulative covering of feathers rather in case of birds. So the right answer is pelage. Uh, pelage vibrissi, uh, not at all because the vibrissi are uh, uh, specialized sensory hairs in some kind of mammals and fur, very thick coat. So the coat of hair in mammals called as pelage. So the next one, the milk that mammary glands secrete contain water, carbohydrate, fats, and uh, it means uh, what is the composition of the milk? Uh, it, because uh, the mammary gland secrete the special milk for the, uh, for the uh, feed, feeding of the young ones. It consists of water, it consists of carbohydrate, fats, and either protein, minerals, antibodies, or all of these. The right answer is all of these because uh, proteins, minerals, and antibodies are also present in the milk of the mother. So blank have memory glands that lack nipples. Uh, which kind of uh, animals, or you can say the mammals that have memory gland, but there are not, there is not presence of uh, uh, the nipples. So Either these are monotremes, marsupial mammals, metatherians, or eutherians. Eutherians have proper uh, nipple structure, and the metatherian same, like the metatherians and marsupial are same. So the right answer is monotremes. That means duckbill, platypus, and echidna uh, are the are belong to the group monotremes. So that's why they are they are uh, the right answer is monotremes. The next one is uh, MCQ number sixteen. Scent or musk gland are around the feet or anus of many mammals. Uh, many mammals ki anus, uske feet aur uske face ke ird gir jai, wo ye scent gland jai, wo exist karte hain. MC number 17, erectile pili muscles are under the control of what? Erectile pili muscles are the specialized muscles that are activated in, a, uh, in, in certain conditions like the flight or fly, uh, fight or in flight situations, especially in case of the mammals. Uh, so uh, which one is the nervous system that control this uh, uh, contraction or erection of the erector pili muscles. Either this system is parasympathetic nervous system, somatic nervous system, central nervous system, or autonomic nervous system. The very appropriate answer is option C, autonomic nervous system, because these are a self-controlled, uh, not controlled by the body. These are uh, these are the uh, uh, self-stimulated kind of uh, muscles. So large sudoriferous glands. Sudoriferous glands are the are also called as the sweat glands. Uh, like apocrine glands, because sudoriferous gland have the two types, that means sweat gland have two types. The small sized uh, are called as the eccrine glands and the large size are called as the uh, apocrine gland. So about the apocrine gland, uh, the apocrine gland secretes a mixture of salt, blank, and water. Uh, either this, this one is secret lipid, no. Protein, no. Carbon, no. The right answer is urea. So the mixture of uh, uh, of the salt, water, and urea secreted from the apocrine gland. It is a kind of sweat gland. Memory glands are probably derived uh, 
uh, evolutionary evolutionary from uh, species gland apocrine gland eccrine gland sand gland apocrine gland uh, <clears throat> the mammary gland was originated or uh, evolved from the apocrine gland kind of sweat gland in mammals teeth are often specialized for different function a condition called definitely heteros hetero mean different so different functions uh, different teeth so that's why the right answer is option b tree sloths have either tree sloths have either The tree sloths have either blank cervical vertebrae or many uh, cervical vertebrae present in the tree sloths. Uh, either these are six or nine, six, seven, nine, or ten. Right answer is six or nine. Uh, but in case of giraffe, there are seven, uh, seven cervical vertebrae. That is the neck vertebrae. So the right answer for tree sloths uh, is option A, six or nine. The next one, a blank is a fermentation pouch uh, where microorganisms aid in cellulose digestion. So a cecum is a fermentation pouch where our microorganism aid in cellular digestion. MC number 23, the primary adaptation of the mam mammalian nephron is a portion of the tubule system called uh, the loop of Henle, proximal tubules, distal tubule, collecting ducts. The primary adaptation of mammalian nephron is the development of a U-shaped structure or in the U-shaped tubule that uh, is present in the, in, in the nephron of the mammals. So this one is the loop of Henle. Or this one is also a loop of a nephron. Australian hooping mice produce urine that is uh, almost blank times more concentrated than blood. It is 22 times more concentrated than blood. Option C is the right answer for this MCQ, number 24. Gestation period in African elephants is about. Gestation period is a time period uh, when an animal, uh, when the embryo is developed uh, into the body of the uh, mother womb. So the gestation period in African elephant, that is a longest kind of uh, uh, longest uh, one kind of uh, gestation period in any kind of mammal and it is about 19 months and the shortest one is present in mice that is only for 20 20 days but in case of a freaking elephant uh, it is about uh, for 19 months so uh, this is totally about the mammals that are uh, existed throughout the world so uh, thank you very much inshallah uh, i will I give another kind of presentation as soon. Allah Hafiz.